Hi friends, today we're going to read Who Would Win, Rhino versus Hippo? Who do you think would win? Hmm, I'm not sure either, but let's find out. What would happen if a rhinoceros came face to face with a hippopotamus? What if they had a fight? Who do you think would win? Meet a rhino. Rhino is a shortened version of rhinoceros, which means nose horn. They certainly do have horns. This is a white rhino. Fun fact, white rhinos cannot swim. Did you know the white rhino is the second largest land mammal? Only elephants are bigger. Meet a hippo. Hippo is a shortened version of hippopotamus. Hippopotamus means river horse. From now on, we will call them rhino and hippo. Says fact, hippos are mammals. A mammal is a warm-blooded animal with fur or hair that gives milk to its young. Oh, and look at all the types of rhinos. There are five types of rhinos. White rhino's name may have come from the Dutch word weed, which means wide, as in wide lips. White rhinos and black rhinos actually both look gray and look alike. Indian rhino, Indian and Javan rhinos have only one horn. Oh, and see some of the other ones, they have a little horn and then they have the big horn. And then there's also a Sumatran rhino. Types of hippos. There are two types of hippos. Hippopotamus or the pygmy hippo. The pygmy hippo is half as tall as a hippopotamus and it only weighs one fourth as much as a hippo. So it's just a small hippo. White rhino territory. White rhinos live in Africa. It says white rhinos lived originally here and it's on the, the pink part. And then it says the X's are where white rhinos have been reintroduced. So it means that they, they, there weren't any there after a while and they brought some back. And it says they've been on earth for 50 million years and they live in grasslands and savannas. A savanna is a grassy area with a few trees. So we're learning a lot of things, aren't we? So now the hippo territory it says hippos also live in Africa. Hippos prefer to live in swampy areas near lakes, rivers, and streams. Did you know that resting in water helps hippos stay cool? And all those places where you see blue on the map, those are all hippo territory. Rhino diet. White rhinos eat grass, 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 and more grass. Rhinos are not meat eaters. They have no interest in eating a hippo. White rhinos have wide lips. They pull up grass with their lips. They chew the grass with their back molars. Do you think you could pull up grass with your lips? I don't think I could. <laughs> this is a baby rhino. It says, tummy fact, a rhino has four sections in its stomach. It takes a lot to digest grass. It says, fun fact, when rhinos are born, they can weigh up to 90 pounds. Hippos also eat grass and some leaves. They prefer to eat at night and they rest during the day. Areas that have been eaten by hippos are called hippo lawns. Hippo lawns? That's funny. Hippo baby, what is cuter, a baby hippo or a rhino? And it says a baby hippo weighs between 60 and 100 pounds. Rhinoceros skeleton, a rhinoceros is a vertebrae animal. Vertebrae have backbones, just like humans. Did you know a rhinoceros has a heavy head? And it says fact, this is a rhinoceros beetle and they have a big scientific name for it, but it's very hard to say. This insect shares its name with the rhino. Kind of looks like a rhino, doesn't he? Hippopotamus skeleton. A hippopotamus is also a vertebrae. Its spinal cord runs from its brain to its tail. Hippos have shorter bones at the shoulder because they spend so much time in the water. This is a hippopotamus beetle. You think that's a real beetle? <laughs> It says, it gives its name, and it says, did you know one of the insects on these two pages is fake? Which one? I think we know which one, don't we? I've never seen a beetle look like that. <laughs> Free ride. How would you like to ride around on a rhino? That's what oxpeckers do. These birds eat ticks, fleas, blood-sucking flies, and insect larvae off the backs of rhinos. Well, 
And it says they also eat earwax. Gross fact. Fun fact, oxpeckers also eat, are also called tick birds. Color fact, oxpeckers are easy to recognize. They have red eyes and red beaks. Hmm. And they, oxpeckers live only where there are larger mammals. They also like to ride on cattle, giraffes, zebra, and buffalo. Some scientists think it is a mutual relationship in which the Ryan and the oxpecker both benefit. Others think the bird is a parasite, means it's taking but not giving. Free cleaning. The hippo loves the water. One reason might be the carp that clean its teeth, hide, and lips. So a carp is a type of freshwater fish. This is, there is also a fish that follows hippos and eats their waste. Boy, nature is interesting. A hippo can hold its breath for five minutes. I bet if we tried that, I don't think we could hold our breath that long. That's a long, long time. Hippos love fresh water and so do humans. This sometimes create conflicts between people and hippos. A rhino foot. A rhino foot has three toes. Did you know an elephant foot has five toes? Hippo toes. A hippo foot has four toes. So now we have one animal that has three toes, one that has four toes, and one that has five toes. So it says four is an even number. Some animals have an even number of toes and some have an odd number of toes. What do we have? How many toes do, do people have on one foot? Yeah, we have five toes. Is that an even number or an odd number? Right, that's an odd number. A horse foot has one toe. Look at that. Rhino weapons. A rhino's best weapon is its size. It is huge. Rhinos stand six feet high at the shoulders and weigh 8,000 pounds. Wow. The rhino's horn is made of keratin. Keratin is the same material that your hair and fingernails are made of. Four tons. Did you know 8,000 pounds equals four tons? That's very, very heavy. Hippo weapons. The hippo's best weapons are its huge teeth and strong jaw. It has six big front teeth on its upper jaw and four teeth plus two long tusks on its lower jaw. It chews with its back molars. It says, fact, elephants, hippos, walrus, and wild boars have tusks. A tusk is a long pointed tooth. Tusks are usually found in pairs. A hippo size is also a great weapon. He weighs three tons. Do we have tusks? Do you see any tusks? No, we don't have tusks, do we? Rhino skin. Rhinos are mammals, but they have almost no hair. Rhinos roll in the mud to protect their skin from the hot sun. So it says human skin thickness, an eighth of an inch. Elephant skin thickness, one inch. So they have much thicker skin so they can stay out in that hot sun. They don't even need sunscreen. Hippos also have almost no hair. Hippo skin looks like armor, but it's actually very sensitive. It says hippos have a natural skin lotion. Their skin oozes a reddish orange oil, but it's not blood. So it says white rhino skin thickness, one and a half inches. Hippo skin thickness, two inches. So we're getting some really thick skin there. It says, I hear you. The rhino can swivel its ears in different directions. It has excellent hearing. A group of rhinos is called a crash. I think that's a good name for a group of rhinos because I think they'd crash into everything. Did you know a rhino can smell and hear a lion before it sees it? It's probably good protection. And what about us? Can we swivel our ears in different directions? <laughs> no. I see you, says the hippo's head is beautifully designed. When swimming, its ears, nose, and eyes are above water. It's always on the lookout. A group of hippos is called a bloat. Did you know a hippo can sleep underwater? While sleeping, it surfaces every five minutes to breathe, right? Because we learned it can hold its breath for five minutes. You think it wakes them up? Hmm, doesn't say that, so I'm not sure. Rhino speed. In short bursts, the rhino can run 30 miles an hour. A rhino can easily outrun a human. A rhinoceros can gallop like a horse. Hippo speed. A hippo can run about 18 miles per hour. 
A hippo has no interest in running a marathon. It's not designed for long distance running. Did you know a hippo can outrun most humans? Did you know, according to zoologists, the closest relatives to hippos are dolphins and whales? A zoologist is a scientist who studies animals and animal behavior. Listen, I told the illustrator not to show the rhino's rear end, but he did. And it has a little note, it says, Dear Rob, I don't think it's a good idea to show the rhino's rear end, Jerry. <laughs> it says, did you know the tail of a rhino has no significant function? So there's no reason for the tail that we know of. It says, don't do it. I asked the illustrator not to show the hippo's rear end either. It says, Rob, I think the editor and the art director are upset that you showed the hippo's rear end, Jerry. It says, Jerry, I'm the art director. Please leave me alone, Rob. <laughs> Did you know from behind the hippo and the rhino look similar? Yeah, pretty good, but I see the hippo has a different sort of tail. The hippo has a small tail. It's not like a snow leopard tail, not, nor, not fluffy like a horse tail, and not good for balance like a kangaroo tail. The thirsty rhino walks over to the watering hole. As the rhino takes a drink, the hippo opens its mouth and scares the rhino away. The thirsty rhino tries again. The hippo opens its big mouth and the frightened rhino backs off. Mm. Later, the hippo wants a drink. This time, the rhino charges and chases the hippo. The hippo returns. The rhino lowers its head and flashes its horn, and the hippo runs away. Rhinos don't eat hippos. Hippos don't eat rhinos, but they're fighting for the same water. Again, the hippo opens its mouth, and the rhino runs away. The rhino returns and charges the hippo. At the last second, the hippo turns around and opens its powerful jaws. The rhino retreats. The rhino slowly walks back with its head down and horns ready. The hippo swings around quickly and bites the rhino on the hind leg. Ouch! The rhino's leg is broken. It limps away. The rhino has made a fatal mistake. Goodness. So sometimes they do end up maybe fighting each other just so they could get some nice clean water, right? But most of the time, I think they just kind of stay away from each other because hmm. they don't really want to eat each other. No. What do they eat? Yeah, that's right. Grass. <laughs> All right. Well, you know what? I don't have any hippos or rhinos where I live. All I have is two sleeping kitty cats. So I'm going to go spend some time with them and I hope you have a great day. Bye-bye.